Phase change unit, lesson 1.2, introducing Titan's disappearing lake. Activity two, discussing difference in appearance. How can the appearance of a substance change without it becoming a different substance? This will be a central question guiding activities and content throughout the unit. Earth is the only place in the universe where we have found evidence of water in all three phases, liquid, water, solid water or ice, and water vapor, or gas, in the air. However, NASA recently found evidence that Titan, one of Saturn's moons, has lakes and seas on its surface. We'll watch a video to learn more. In the video, we will meet two real-life scientists investigating a lake on Titan. As you watch, listen for answers to each of these questions. What questions about Titan are Dr. Malaska and Dr. Alex Hayes trying to answer through their research? What evidence are they using to answer these questions? We will meet Dr. Alex Hayes, a planetary geologist, and Dr. Mike Malaska, a chemist. Students, play the video. What questions about Titan are the scientists trying to answer? You might respond, Dr. Malaska uses evidence from the experiments he conducts in his lab to learn more about the conditions under which methane changes phases. What evidence are they using to answer these questions? You might answer that Dr. Hayes uses photos of Titan's surface taken by a satellite to determine what is happening to Titan's disappearing lakes. As Dr. Hayes and Dr. Malaska mentioned, there are many lakes on Titan. In this unit, we are going to focus on one particular mysterious lake made primarily of methane. The methane found on Titan is the subject of much research. The lakes on Titan are real, and several lakes on Titan really do seem to have disappeared. Although the problem you're solving does exist, there are some aspects of this unit that are fictional. The Universal Space Agency and the head scientist you will communicate with, for example, are not real. However, the science and the scientist and the agency are meant to mimic real scientists and space agencies involved in investigating this real-life mystery. Dr. Flores, a lead chemist at the Universal Space Agency, has sent a message with information about the mystery of Titan's missing lake. <clears throat> Two student chemists from Dr. Daniela Flores, lead chemist at the Universal Space Agency. Subject, missing lake on Titan. Dear student chemists, scientists at the Universal Space Agency are investigating what happened to one of the methane lakes on Titan. The following slides depict the same location at two different times. As you will see, the location looks very different in the two pictures. As student chemists, we ask for your help in determining what happened to the missing lake. Thanks, Dr. Flores. What happened to the lake? Scientists note that a dark area is in the photos from a NASA probe in 2007. The area outlined in blue is a liquid lake. Two years later, the area outlined in blue is now much lighter. What happened to the lake? Chapter 1 question. What happened to the liquid in Titan's lake? Let's investigate this question further. Scientists know the lake was there in 2007 because it was a different color than the surrounding area. What do you think happened to the lake? Freezing and evaporating claims. The lake in the area in 2009 claim the lake froze. Claim the lake evaporated. Scientists at the Universal Space Agency have developed two claims about what could have happened to the lake. The diagrams of these claims show what might have happened if the lake froze or if it evaporated. In this unit, you'll use your understanding of chemistry to explain what happened to the lake on Titan. As we read in the message, the two claims for what happened to the lake are both examples of phase changes. The methane in the lake either evaporated or froze. This question will help us figure out if the methane lake on Titan froze or evaporated. Investigation question. How does the appearance of a substance change when it changes phase? We cannot directly study phase changes on Titan. Instead, we will study videos of phase changes on Earth to help us understand what is happening on Titan. We will watch videos showing everyday examples of phase changes on Earth to better understand how the appearance of a substance changes when it changes phase. I will play each video twice and then ask you to share observations of how each substance changed. Students, play this video twice. Students, play this video twice. Students, play the third video twice. And finally, play the final video twice. 
Describe the change that happened in each video. You might respond, the liquid changed into a gas or a solid. The gas and the solid both change into a liquid, as an example. Vocabulary. Phase. A noticeably different form or state of the same substance. Throughout the unit, you can look up vocabulary words in the glossary to help you understand what they mean. Let's think about how matter can change from one phase to another. How do you see a solid change phase in one of the videos? Do you know the word scientists use to describe the change of a substance from a solid to a liquid? To those questions, you might respond, a solid changes into a liquid. It's called melting. The three other changes that can occur between the phases of matter you saw in the videos include melting, freezing, evaporating, and condensing. How did you see these changes happen in the video? A solid turning to a liquid is called melting. A liquid turning to a solid is called freezing. Where could you add the words melting and freezing to the diagram? A liquid turning to gas is called evaporation. A gas turning to a liquid is called condensation. Where could you add the words evaporation and condensation to this diagram? In Partners, you'll now choose one video and try to more precisely describe how the substance changes in that video. You'll then answer the questions using words from the word bank in your responses. Students, choose a video and begin discussing how to best answer these questions. You may refer to digital resources to rewatch the videos. At this point, how would you answer our investigation question? Are all the phases of water visible? You might say, no, gas is invisible. What is the difference about the way water moves in different phases? You might say, a solid moves as one piece while liquid flows. And what is the difference about water in different phases in containers? Liquid fills the bottom of a container while gas fills the whole container. Key concept, a solid holds its shape and does not take the shape of its container. Key concept two, a gas has no visible shape and fills its container. And the third key concept, a liquid flows and can take the shape of its container. End of activity.